Okay, so we're back. Um, since I saw you last, I've actually um, gone and utilised the library to do a bit of stat grinding. Uh, got all my stats up to four, and except for cooking, which I got up to five, as you can see. Um, that's basically so we've got a uh, got our bases covered. Yeah, I think that's everything I need for the quests we got in the minute. Uh, might need more for these two quests, but we'll find out when we get to them. Uh, did a bit of furniture shopping. Um, bought myself a mirror for some charisma training. And I uh, found a burglar alarm at long last. Uh, weirdly, it was Giuseppe selling that, which I'm pretty sure he is the burglar, but, you know. So I'm um, just going to quickly go over the methods I used when I was doing this. So my basic pattern was start at home. I then sort of went round town doing any jobs I could find. So sort of start at the uncle's to do mowing, then went fishing, then did the weightlifting at the gym. And then I'd run around the shops, uh, check over here, and just sort of, um, you know, oops, didn't mean to press that, uh, you know, see if they had anything good for sale, which was how I got the uh, things I needed. Basically looking for A, the burglar alarm, and B, anything that would help me raise my stats. So once I had some money and got any furniture I wanted, I'd then spend the next few days basically going to the library and just reading the books. Once I'd, basically once my stats ran out and I'd come back home, freshen up, rest, and then just keep sort of alternating between here and there to get everything up where I needed it. So that was basically how I went about getting my stats up. Um, as a also got this painting. Uh, <laughs> 20 minutes too important. Oh well. So um, what I'm going to do now is we're going to start and experience the paranormal. Um, I got my logic up to four in the library so I could answer the go <laughs> and um, learn crazy talk I guess. And I think having the high mechanical skill will get us through the uh, locked gate. So first things first I need a manhole. There we go. I need to find the ghost's ashes. I'm pretty sure they're down here but uh Maybe I have to talk to the ghost first for that. Yeah, maybe he knows where they are. Not right place. It's uh, further left. Don't stand on the button. Ooh, uranium rod. One. <clears throat> okay, should be round here. It's this one. There we go. So should be able to pick the lock now, I think. Because I got four mechanical. I think that should be enough. If not, I'm going to be embarrassed. There you go. Gates open. Right, let's go inside. Hmm, some nice furniture here. A few paintings, nice chairs. Go actually find the ghost, actually. Is that a... Oh my god, that's a guillotine. Eww! Jeez, that thing cuts. Works. So where's the ghost? Maybe he's only around at night. I hadn't considered that. Ooh, this music's getting funky. Yeah, I could be into this. Yeah, I like that. Alright, maybe I should wait until night time. I hadn't considered that. Let's take a few naps. Yeah, this is some good music. This is my jam. That sort of spooky disco vibe to it. Uh, might have to leave here, actually, and just go... Uh, use the bathroom, because I don't want to be talking to the ghost and then have, like, I have to go back because my stats are too low. You know, one of my stats has run out. I need to come up with a better way of naming these things. I keep saying stats. Sometimes I mean, like, my skills, and sometimes I mean my, uh, my, um, uh, what do you call them? Needs. Yeah, I'm going to call them that. I'm going to call them skills and needs from now on. I might say stats by mistake, because I do that sometimes, but, uh, yeah. Okay, so I'll sleep till, I uh, no, six? Six thirty, because I want to catch the ghost. I'm pretty sure he'll only be out at night. 
And this should give it time for me to meet him, hopefully. Hey, at seven o'clock. Night time, perfect. All right, let's find us a ghost. Uh, where is he? Is he not here? Do I have to do something first? Maybe he's outside. I don't see a ghost. It's night time, I thought he'd be here. Maybe midnight? I just keep running around, he'll show up sooner or later. I am seriously into this music though, this is good. So, I don't know, I just get that... I can't explain it. Sometimes when you get that spooky noise like mixed into music, I don't know, I just enjoy it. Where's the ghost? It must be midnight, it has to be. There. It's past midnight. Ooh, what's that? Ooh, is he... Oh, uh, I think that was the um, emulator making him not show up. That could be problematic. So this is Ephraim Earl. Ephraim Earl. What's the pun there? Ephemeral. Hi, I'm Harry. <laughs> what kind of name is that? <laughs> yeah, I can see you're dead. Yeah, he... Oh, this guy's weird. Hey, yeah, you seem a decent guy. You stand here perhaps wondering if you should be here at all, and my answer is what? I don't want to call him illogical, but I don't want to call him odd either. Those might offend him. <laughs> what the heck is that supposed to mean? Why are you talking clearly now? Yeah, that politician was a uh, sort of insulting. Is this stuff yours? Okay, so I answer your riddles and I get your furniture. Nice. Yeah, give me some riddles. How many sides does a circle have? Uh, inside and outside. Two. Hey! Got it. Which does not belong in this group? Apple, grape, banana, or pear? Apple, grape, banana, pear. Hmm. Which doesn't belong in the group? Oh, uh, banana. The others all have an E and an A in them. Banana's just A's. Oh. <laughs> that, wasn't my <laughs> that wasn't my intended answer, but, uh... Alright. How many letters are in the alphabet? So that's going to be a counting one. So that's, uh, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Let me count that again to be sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Huh? Alright, um, 11? Did I miscount? What was I counting wrong then? 1, 2, 3 and the... 4, 8, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... Oh, only 11. Where was I getting the 12th letter from? What other letter fit, fits in the following series? B, C, D, I, K, O and X. Uh, that's going to be H because they're all the si they're all uh, symmetrical. When I'm filled, I can point the way. When I'm empty, nothing moves me. I have two skins: one without and one within. What am I? A glove points the way when it's full, so I go for a glove. Hey, I got him. <laughs> that's completely different. <laughs> that's for something completely different. Uh. No, he doesn't know where a band can jam. Here, have a painting. Oh. 
All right, so we answered his riddles, and we are. Uh, it. That's the emulator messing him up. So he uh, said we could take the furniture, didn't he? Maybe we have to. Um, maybe I have to find his ashes first. I wonder where they're gonna be. Ooh, wrong one. Can I take the guillotine? No. Alright, I think now should be a good time to head back to Uncle's. Ah, see, now he's working just perfectly. I think he's supposed to flicker in and out because he's a ghost, but as I said, the emulator's working weirdly with it. Alright, where's his ashes going to be? Yeah, don't get stuck. All I can think is in the sewers. Because I have to use the sewers to get here. But as I said, I think probably best go to Uncle's right now and freshen up and then look for them in the morning, I think. Hey Uncle, I'm crashing here tonight. <laughs> I've been talking to a ghost. It's very stressful. Yeah, I think Uncle is like in his house. And actually, no, I'm, I was going to say I think he's the only person you ever see sleeping, but um, I think if you invite another Sim to live with you, they will use your furniture as well. So I think you can see others sleeping apart from just you and Uncle, actually. So forget what I was saying because I wasn't paying attention to what I was saying in the first place. Okay, ashes. They're going to be down here somewhere. I think. Might just look up where they are if I can't find them. I th seem to remember them being down here. There's a jar. I'll take that. No, not there. Can't go up that way, even though it's clearly a path. <laughs> okay, where are they? Aha! Yep, urn. <laughs> I'm not going to rub the urn if it's going to amuse the ghost. I'm not here to help some old dead guy get <laughs> get aroused or whatever's going to happen. Anyway, I'll go give him his ashes back because he probably wants them. I mean, ashes, you know, it seems kind of personal, you know. Alright, let's see if he's still around. Yo, buddy, you around? I oh, don't tell me I'm too late. And he's gone. Or is the emulator just messing with me again? No, I think I've left it too long and he's vanished. Alright, maybe I'll go do a different... Yeah, he's gone. Might be best to go do a different quest for a bit and then, uh. Yeah, you know, I'll come back tonight and see if he's here. Of course, now I can just phone him, uh. I think. Does he have a phone? I assume he has a phone. Alright, so I'll do a different quest for a bit and see what we can do, uh. Find a place to jam, acquire a cool guitar, impress the local band leader. Befriend the cook, pay my entry fee. I don't have the entry fee, I need to grind money for that. Uh, probably want to do that off camera because it's quite expensive. Find a place to jam though, so I need to talk to anyone who might know somewhere to jam. Uh, let's see, there's a... Well, the band leader is who I have to impress and she doesn't know where to go yet, so... Uh, maybe that Mel dude does, he's a... Uh, yeah, his name's Melodious, that's kind of musical, so he might know. And he needs to find where to buy a guitar. Giuseppe might have one, I guess? Seems like the sort of thing he'd sell. So first, I'm going to earn some money. Oh, yeah, and I got a few promotions as well while I was uh, off camera. Whoa, that's a swordfish. 160 for one fish? Nice!
Whatever fish that is over there is going to be a good one. If I can catch another swordfish, that would be great. Like, no, didn't want to do that, no. Okay. Another swordfish, come on. Ooh, look at all that money. Yeah, I think the fishing minigame is actually one of the best ones for money because, um... It's fairly easy, you're just mashing the same two buttons. And also, it's quick. You know, mowing Uncle's Lawn is an easy one, but it takes a while to do. Whereas the fishing is fairly, you know, fairly easy. Okay, he doesn't know anything. I guess I just gotta ask everyone if they know anywhere. Nope. Alright, there's Vera. Can I join your band? Yeah, I like to sing and dance. I'm not very good at it, though. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, so I actually need a guitar. And I need to impress her. Uh, let's go for some compliments. Now, that sounds like I'm insulting her, but... <laughs> I don't know, I like goths. You electrocuted yourself on stage? What? Okay, rumours she doesn't like. This g- Oh, damn it! <laughs> okay, she likes being flattered. Uh, here, have a painting. Don't insult my work. Okay, she's going to be hard to impress, so I might have to work at that later. Uh, stats are getting low, might head home for a bit. Hey, hey, here's my bike. Other way, you. Okay, let's just pop home a sec and uh, freshen up. Yes, I know you need the bathroom, that's why we're at home. You also need food and other things. Okay, uh, bathroom. Where did I leave the bathroom? This way. Also, be good actually if once I've helped the uh, ghost and I get his furniture, because I can then replace some of the stuff in my house. Because uh, I haven't really bought new furniture in a while. Well, I've bought new stuff, but not to replace old stuff. Yeah, you know, my old furniture is getting a bit worn out. I think. So I guess it'd be nice. Yeah, good to have some new furniture around. Because I think more expensive furniture raises your stats quicker. I think. Which obviously means you can uh, spend more time actually doing things. Okay, I'll sleep until night time and we'll go find the ghost again. So I can give him his uh, ashes back. And hopefully as well as, um, because it's night. As long as I can get the ashes back to him, I should be able to then find Giuseppe and see if he's got a guitar. Seems like the sort of thing he'd sell. So I don't think there'd be one at the general store, and there certainly wouldn't be one at the furniture store, because it's not really furniture, is it, a guitar? Whereas Giuseppe sort of sells everything, so I guess it would be there. Hey ghost, you in? Hello? Do I have to wait till midnight again? Guess so. Okay, midnight. Ghost! Hey, there he is. 
Stop <laughs> asking him about that. Yep, there's your ashes. Can you rest in... Yes, can you rest now? Ooh, a secret cellar. Alright. Where's the secret cellar? He said I can have anything from the secret cellar, but where is it? Ah, it must be outside. Let's have a look around here. Yep, <laughs> how did I miss that? Alright, let's see what he's got. Okay, so we've got a, a sarcophagus. That's nice, so I'm going to put that in my house. Crystal ball. A uh, fly trap. That might be dangerous. And some armor. What's over here? I don't even know what that is. A fountain. Alright, so we've got some cool decorations for our home. Nice. And a mouse. So that's... Yeah, let's see. Sarcophaga. King Foot. Who died of a hippopotamus attacker. Uh, actually, hippos are very dangerous in real life. Uh, crest the ball. I wonder if this thing will eat me. I know they do sometimes in the main sim games. Alright, do I sell this stuff or use it to decorate my home? I might go see Giuseppe. If it's worth much, I might sell it so I can use it for the other quest. If not, I'm going to stick it in my home. Have some nice decoration around the place. Or should I just spend some time grinding money off screen? That would probably be easier. Giuseppe! Yeah, you got a guitar? Yes! Oh, and he's got the monkey butler. Okay, got the guitar. And another Zen fountain. Ooh, that's expensive. Nah, I'm gonna keep it. Okay, so we got the guitar now. We still need somewhere to jam, and we still need to impress a uh, Vera Vex, which isn't gonna be easy. <clears throat> she seems. No, I'm... I don't want to go in the pet store. I'm not buying any pets. They're a pain. Why is the detective outside my house? Alright, let's um let's stick some furniture around. I think I'll put the Venus fly trap in the kitchen, like that. Uh down here looks a good place for our sarcophagus. Not like that, that looks awful. <laughs> That's a <coughs> That was quite jank. There we go, that's uh, still bad. There's a mummy. <laughs> that's cool. Uh, let's have a look here. I'll stick this there. Oh, that makes me less tired. Interesting. So I can use that instead of my bed. Good to know, good to know. A uh, suit of armour I want in my room, because that's cool. Put it next to the chimney. Well, that one doesn't move, that's okay. Fountain, uh, well, that's got to be bathroom. Nice fountain. Do I have to keep the guitar or can I put it somewhere put it down somewhere? I think I'll chuck that in here with the uh, other stuff for the minute. Okay, I can't put it up there, but I can put it down here for some reason. Or <coughs> And I can use it for creativity studying. That's good. Okay, got some new furniture. Uh, 
finish the quest. I've actually been dragging this on for quite a bit, uh, this part. It's a bit longer than normal, so I'll end this part here. And uh, next part, we all try and start working towards being a rock star. I'll see you then. Goodbye. <laughs>